Hi, I'm Dr. Ian Storch, and this is just a quick review on the Miralax prep. So a lot of people sit in the office and we go over the prep and then they get home and they don't remember. So the first thing I'm going to tell you is to make sure you do your COVID test the day before the procedure. So right now we are requiring a rapid test the day before, which you can take a picture of and bring on the day of your procedure. Although it can be done in the office on the day of the procedure, we don't recommend this because you're gonna be doing a full colon prep and you wanna make sure that you're COVID negative before you drink the prep. So the day before, some questions are about blood thinners or about diabetic medications. Those should have been discussed at your appointment. If you have questions, you can call us in the office. After your COVID test is negative, you are going to wake up in the morning and be on a clear liquid diet. We will have provided you that at the time of your appointment. It will be on the website. That's anything that you can put on a newspaper and see the print through, we would consider clear. You can have uh, broth, you can have coffee or tea, no milk. You can have jello, not supposed to be red. Then you're gonna pick up uh, two things. One is a bottle of Miralax or a generic polyethylene glycol. This is maybe a little more than $10 over the counter. It's 238 grams. And you're going to pick up two bottles of Gatorade. So these are two 32-ounce bottles. They also do make a 64-ounce bottle. Um, the regular does have a good amount of sugar. There is one with uh, low sugar. And for diabetics, you can get Gatorade Zero, which has no sugar. These preps uh, are really easy. So you mix the two together, you put it in the refrigerator and you go about your day. Now, for people that are home earlier in the day, either because you're working from home or not working the day before your procedure, you can start the prep early. So I recommend it's easier if you start it early, you can start it at noon and drink a glass every 30 minutes or so. Again, there's eight glasses. So that would take approximately four hours. If you're doing it every 15 minutes, if you did it longer, it could take six or eight hours. Again, if you have the time, the slower you drink the prep, the easier it seems to be. Uh, the general recommendation is for working people. So that's to start at five. And the sheets usually say to do a glass every 15 minutes. I always recommend to people that if they start to get nauseous or bloated, they just slow down the prep. So every 15 minutes, again, we're talking eight glasses should take about two hours. So if you started at six, you'd be done at eight. But again, I don't think there's that much to do the night before your colonoscopy. So I usually recommend slowing down the prep and doing it every 30 or 45 minutes, especially if you feel bloated or uncomfortable while drinking the prep. Uh, this prep will make you go to the bathroom, obviously, and clean out your colon so that you're ready for your colonoscopy. There are many commercial preps that we certainly can prescribe for you, including the pill prep. However, the nice thing about the Miralax prep is that it's generally uh, inexpensive. We don't have to worry about insurance coverage, and it works great. If you have any questions, please call the office before the procedure. But again, I think this video should be helpful. And if you have any questions, watch it again.